Hi my loves and welcome back to my channel. My name is Viona and I am your favorite YouTuber and I make videos where I take you guys on a journey of my learning about self-love and manifestation in my world. Video I am going to tell you guys um the passive income that I am that I recently learned and that I am trying to implement and so I want to share this passive income with you as well and the, it is basically called low content books and what they basically is uh, low content books is where the end user or the customer does most of the work and this is through let's say notebooks, journals, colouring books so those are examples of low content book and they're all low effort because it's really easy to make so you as the creator of the low content book you just create the cover of the book the interior you also create as either lined or dotted pages and so I'm gonna go off and show you on the computer how I make it okay guys so I'm gonna show you how to create the KDP low content book. Here is the uh, how to like create the cover title or the cover of the book. So here are some examples that I made. Um, so in general, the whole process of me creating this book, publishing it and stuff, it took me like around a day for me to do it. But like in reality, it took me over a week of me like trying to figure things out and doing this stuff really, like this really helps you and like you guys can learn this faster this is the first cover that i made um i basically put a lot more effort in this cover and just i drew the flower and then like converted it into like a png so this was kind of one of my favorite covers because i made it myself kind of a sheet and also the strawberry one as well but basically you can see the dimensions you can see like through here find them i chose six times nine inches and it's kind of reflected in book over in this area over here. So one of this is six times nine, but since we're doing the front and back of the cover, you kind of have a times it by two. This is the file size of the six times book cover, just in case you wanted to know. This is what it looks like, and I use Canva to create my covers. So it's just really easy. You can use um, Adobe Photoshop as well. I just find this is so much more easier and basically you can do whatever you want to create the cover so I just switch up some elements as you can see down here as well do repeating elements like so so you see in here I basically repeated the elements over and over again and create this cover you can also change the color of some elements as well change it blue so you can have a blue instead of a golden one so you can basically do like let's say for this book cover you can do like different variations different colors as you can see down below that i kind of made this notebook cover thing in different variations of colors so you can also do that and that's what's so great about like content books is you make covers that are different variations some people would want a different color so this is really simple so you could literally just make cover like so and then let's say you want a text right so if I add a heading and call this notebook so the middle is like around here somewhere so I think yep you can also change the background color as well so let's say I want to get a really nice pink color I can also change the elements as well so canva allows that as well you can make it into a nice pink one and then change this to a dark so it kind of blends in so it's really cute this is like the most simplest design ever and basically what do you want to do next is you want to go to book bolt so this is what i found from the um two youtube videos that i watch is they kind of make kind of use this app help with their low content books um i just thought it goes it's actually nine dollars 99 usd which is 14 dollars aud um because i'm australian basically you have this page right here and you can do your own research using this app so you can do keywords and then if i do that a gratitude journal and search um all this information petition there is for this particular keyword okay so this is how much searches it is for amazon and google and how much cost per click cost per click it is for this particular keyword to be honest i have no clue what these all mean 
like specifically what AMZCV mean, but cost per click is it's basically how much they charge if they particular keyword to get like a customer lead to the website. So that's how much it costs. You can see what books people sell on Amazon as well. Lowest price they sell it for the highest price they sell it for, and the average price. So the average price of the book is seven dollars eighty for USD. You can also see what people create as like a gratitude journal and how much they sell. So as you can see here as an estimation estimated sell of 294 and here are all the ratings so as you can see this is a very popular book because it's 266 it shows the description and it shows like what kind of keywords they use for the title as well as you can see this is a heck of a long title but you kind of need to describe or put important keywords in the title so it's very easy for people to search for your products but if you see here this is the creation part of book bolt so you can actually create your own cover page i kind of don't recommend it because i tried using it and the dimensions don't really fit well with the KDP Amazon's guidelines. So I recommend using Canva because it's just easy. Like you can just put your customized dimensions inside. So you can go to interior. This is what I like most about BookBot is you can basically customize and create an easy interior low content. So as you can see here, it's like multiple templates that's already been made for you. Let's say I want to create a journal, like a nook. I would generally use this design or this design or a bullet journal design which is somewhere up here and then I would kind of like market the same cover into different variations depending on the internal what's internal template that is used so I can do literally one three different notebooks that I can sell using the same cover because the, because the interior is different so how this works is basically if you pick one template let's say this journal template basically the whole book page is going to be template right here which is why low content books are so easy to make i believe it's a good idea to to do because they are really easy to make and easy to design and basically the end i'm going to do a bleed design because we kind of need bleed for the amazon pdf guidelines and it's basically six to nine and you can put how many um, page counts that you want i usually do 200 because if you think about it one page is basically two page two pages back to front so if it's if you're going to type in 200 pages in reality amazon's only going to print out 100 pages of the book it makes sense they have so many different like types of templates but i am only going to use the journal and the bullet journal because those are the most simplest ones to use so i already pre-downloaded everything else um i'm gonna download to show you guys make sure you download it in the pdf print okay so now i'm just publishing the book so here are the three options we have kindle ebook paperback and hardcover we are going to do paperback because we want to actually sell the hard copy journal of it so here it is Gonna press on it um, and so basically the book title like just like the description it's basically the description of the title of the book so i'm filling it out here's gonna be a butterfly pink butterfly journal so just add a, like as many keywords as you need that kind of describes like what the product is so it's easy to find when customers search for it and then so usually i do like a little comma and i put like the dimensions of the book so six nine and the description is basically the description of the product design notebook journal perfect for writing so basically this is a very short summary you can if you're really good at copywriting you can add more stuff to it i just cannot think of another of other descriptions to write but basically what it is basically what is good for and like the features so here are the features i added inside actually writes so just put that in and this is your keywords this is where book really comes in handy because it gives you the keywords that you need to use for so just for the section say it's optional to put your keywords in i highly highly recommend you guys to add keywords because so that's how we're also going to switch um the product as well i'm just going to put in the keywords so here are the categories oh my god i literally spent like two hours trying to find the right category so i'm just going to show you guys exactly what categories to choose this is the main category you can choose two different categories um so the second one is you can choose whatever category is helps you as a product but if for notebooks and journals this is the category that's best to put it in so literally collections and then diaries and journals i don't know why it took me so long to find this i spent it two hours i was getting frustrated and i was trying to find how to, the right category for this 
and yeah this is it and the other one i just put like non-fiction and self-help and general so self-help and then i just take the general part and that's it because i have adult content no make them just assign a free kdp ibsn and so i'm going to use a black house white interior these are my settings pdf only and matte and then this manuscript just upload the book bulk manuscript the book bulk interior they had with that I'm going to upload the interior that I had before the, for the book that I created in BookBolt. I'm just going to upload it now. And then I'm going to upload the cover that I created as well. So hopefully everything's all right and in line. And now we're going to launch preview just to see looks everything's good. This is what it, the preview looks like. This is why it's so important to preview and approve your um, book cover before it actually starts. So this is what it looks like. You can actually, actually also see the inside as well. So as you can see, the inside is the exact same. Every single page for 200 pages. Which is gonna be, you have, all you have to do is how much it will cost to print your book. So that's $3.25 US as how much it costs to print on Amazon. So here we're going to do basically how much we're going to price the thing. So Amazon, on top of the printing cost, they're going to take a percentage of whatever you make. But that's just how they are i think it's because of like the market because you're selling on their marketplace that's their terms so the average price for this book specifically is six dollars 75 the lowest being three dollars 95 and the highest being is 90 dollars 99 so we're going to average we're going to price our book averagely so we are going to price around six to seven is she try 699 we expect to make 0 0.94 dollars in a roll which i know it's not a lot but this is something that you create as a low content book so the purpose of the of creating this and doing all this is to create a passive income and there is no upfront cost to this imagine if you if you create like what 20 different books and sell it at 699 you never know the amount of things that you can sell so imagine like let's say you have to check the pricing as well so for japan you will make zero dollars in a relative if you sell it so you have to kind of adjust the price so i use a this amount so i'm getting some income from it so like 92 yen for australia sadly you don't get any income from it if you sell on amazon.com so make sure just do like 11.99 so after you decide it. and then it is done it's going to be seven dollars 45 cents usd yeah, that's pretty practically done as easy and you can literally create all this and literally just make it in under a day that's basically how you do it i really really like a low content book because they're really easy to make as well as have no startup costs and the only cost that it takes is your time honestly when i did this it didn't take me that long i'm still creating some new content book low content book ideas as well and content covers so it is really cool how like you can just create it like when you have free time and then you, know, you never know you might make some income out of it and that is the beauty of this strategy it's like everyone can do it it's so easy that is the end of the video i hope that you guys find it really really informative i will see you guys in my next video